I developed Connect to Scratch, which is software that lets children program the Microsoft Connect using the Scratch programming language from MIT. I thought it'd be cool if I could make my own games, but there was no easy way of doing that. So I developed Connect to Scratch purely to let my seven-year-old, he's nine this month, uh, actually develop uh, games himself. So he makes games now for his younger brothers and sisters, and they're casual games, they're very simple. They're like Space Invaders or Pong. They're ones that children can understand and program themselves. So the idea of Connect to Scratch, I think, is to show that not only can students make games, because all the games here have been made by students from the Bridge 21 team, uh, and you can see some of them playing behind me there. They're, they're secondary school students, and they made these games with Connect to Scratch purely on their own imagination. We've had astronauts on the moon chasing unicorns. We've had dragons and wizards shooting fireballs at each other. We've had a crocodile that doesn't like to eat coconuts. I mean, we, these, these games are full of imagination. But what's more interesting is that to play them, you have to move your body in new, different ways. With the Kinect, you can have the, the paddles and pong controlled by your two hands, or you can move the Space Invader ship by just moving left or right with your head. And that makes all the difference, because kinetic games, where you actually have to move or do gestures to interact with the game, are quite different mentally from just holding a controller and pressing buttons. You now have to use your entire body.